Hi everyone, I'm here to share this journal with you and I'm going to start flipping now while I talk. Um, you can see it's a Jane Austen theme. It is um, quite large. This is from Marie Nowak. Um, she and I did a swap earlier, uh, about a month ago, and she wasn't able to video this before she sent it to me, so she asked me to do that. So here's... Here it is, Marie. And this journal, the reason I'm just starting to flip is because it is huge and I, this is the third time I've done this and I can't get it in under 15 minutes. So honestly, I, um, I'm just going to flip through it and I'm not going to be able to take everything out and show you because uh, it is huge. So she's used, I think, um, some Marion Smith. Uh, I hadn't mentioned to her that Marion Smith's Primrose um, kit was one of my favorites, so uh, she has included some of that, and of course the Jane Austen uh, kits, and I think some of it's Dreams, etc. It's one of my favorite pages, Mary. I do love that uh, rose paper to include in journals. So she's just filled it with all kinds of beautiful paper, um, tuck spots and trims. Um, I just can't even imagine the amount of work that went into this. It's just absolutely beautiful. And she's done these great, like several different tags and things that she's printed on acetate, uh, which I love and I think I'm gonna have to scrap with that idea, Marie, because it's just fabulous. I really like the way that looks. So this is beautiful. And I think it's so big, I think it, it needs a shelf unto itself here in my craft room because uh, I think it's going to push everything else off the shelf. <laughs> it's just beautiful. And she's got this fabulously coffee dyed paper. And Marie, it does actually feel different. I think it might be um, parchment paper rather than uh, coffee paper. Um, it does have uh, certainly a different feel than um, coffee paper does. And this little image she's got underneath that. So you can see things are out of pockets because I this is. As I said, the third time I've, I've done this. Um, I guess if it doesn't work this time, I'm going to have to do uh, a two-parter. You can see, so she's done that as a page, that acetate. This is one of my favorite pages. I love that. And then she's got all kinds of bags with tags and so on. booklets tucked in and just so many beautiful things and tuck spots and things to pull out and look at and I just love this. This was such a fun swap. And then she's got a flip up here and that's a petal envelope that she's used as a flip. So many pretty Rims and so on. And that little envelope. And then more of that paper. And another petal envelope with an insert. on acetate hmm. and then a tuck spot there and that picture of that lady on her hammock I love that and then she's got um, she's used the quill and or yeah the quill and the uh, ink pot as a tuck spot and she's got a couple of 
beautiful tags and things here and wrapped in doilies. I mean, just really, Marie, the work that you did with this is just incredible. Just incredible. And those are more blank pages. You can see it so far. It's hard to get it in frame here. Um, it's so beautiful. So such a thick book. And those are all plain pages. And then tags in here. And that's a coin envelope. And a couple of things there. That's actually another acetate. Oh, I don't know how I've got that in there, but that's another acetate tag that she's got. And a bag with a tag and another large tag. Okay. Nice one of those vintage bags. I love these bags, Marie. Pretty Marie, where did you get that? That uh, very pretty library card. And she's done some stamping, of course. Or flip ups. So, this is the incredible journal that I got from Marie. Isn't it beautiful? And another, that's another um, envelope. So there we go, and in, in a, just a pocket at the back here as well. So I do apologize for such a quick flip because I know it's really hard to see, and but you can see I'm already at nine minutes. So um, I made it this time. Um, Marie, I hope that flip was okay. I know it was really quick. Um, but I know everyone uh, must have really enjoyed that. It's such a beautiful book, uh, and I thank you so much, Marie, for it. Um, so, everyone, I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.